Hi guys, this is Jaka. We'll be playing a bit of Arena. Uh, I'll go for the strongest class at the moment, which is the Rogue. Rogue does not have that many strong taunts, but I think it will be alright here. It's a good card anyway. This is Fletchling. If I get enough control cards, this is really crazy, especially in Rogue. Here is a control card. Direwolf is also good, but Deadly Poison is strictly better. Charge Devil Sword is the best one here. Good as control and removal. This is good as control, removal and reach. So that's really good. Naga Corsair with the good like a crawler is not that strong at the moment. Uh, but I think this will be fine here, especially in the rope class. Speaking of Golaka Crawler, there's some negative synergy there, but I guess I can play around it. Uh, I do not have any two, so I need them. Hmm. Baron Berserker is what I'm leaning towards. I do not have any synergy cards with the elemental, and then the Firefly is not that good. So, Baron Berserker. Control behind Fire Bloom is the best one. Silith uh, Swarmer is a strong card you'd almost always be able to activate in Rogue. Bomb Squad is also really good though. But in Rogue, where you use your hero power a lot and you take a lot of damage in the process, Bomb Squad is not as good. So. AoE is something you do not really have access for in Rogue. But with the Deadly Poison, and I might even draw a. Uh, another weapon card. I think it can be fine. Just to have the option of AOE. Check the Sand Ferryman is a good to drop. What that one? There might be some back. I didn't even check. There are some battle cries. Yeah, sure. Spiteful Smith is really good, especially in Rogue. Have some force already, I think. Three force. I think this will do fine. I like fires. This is initiative as well. I uh, really like that. I want too many heavy cards, and I do have some already that is somewhat heavy. This is also a bit heavy, of course, but not that much. Twisted walking. Just to get a little bit more early game. Cold blood is really good. It's removal and reach. <coughs> Shadow Rage is a good card as well. I'm kinda of getting filled up on threes already. Misting Rock, it's a very good card. Uh, yeah. And Venom Weapon. Well, actually, I do not have that much removal, hard removal as it is. The closest thing I have right now is the Charged Devil Sword. So, and Venom Weapon is really good. Hmm. 
the uh, Twilight Drago Abomination. What I like about Abomination is that we have this AoE effect even though it is reactive. And your opponent can play around it somewhat. It's something that the rogue really needs. Okay, I'll, I'll take that one. Uh, boom, 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 still on Gastropod. Friendly bartender is good in Rogue also because you can get a health buff or health, not health buff, health uh, regain. Uh, but this is removal. Another hard removal. I do have a lot of threes already. I need heavy, a couple of heavy cards still, but Assassinate is really good. This is a bit slow, it seems like I have a kind of a control deck, so it suits quite well actually. Um, and it has some synergy with the Blade Flurry as well. Uh, I'll go for that one. Oh, I need some heavy cards. I think this will be f good enough just to get a heavy card. Is Bite Wheat better? I don't think I have a fast enough deck for Bite Wheat to be any more than just a 2 2. Uh. Lotus Assassin is really, really good. But to have a silence effect is also really good in this meta. Uh, and it's a hard counter to. Spike Rich Steed. If I come up against the uh, Rogues in uh, the Rogues uh, Paladins, I do have a lot of fives already. I would really like to trade in a Nesting Rock for a Lotus Assassin and then pick the Fire Screamer. Uh, I don't have many fires. I'll, I'll go for the fires. I need. I'm not sure if I need it, but there's room for more fours. This is fine. Mm. Well, bit of Titan Hydra is not that good because I really need my. Um, my health, and I do have actually a couple of elementals now, right? It's too bad Shadow Rage is not one. I have two. Uh, well, this is just a heavy card, and I need that. I have no nothing on seven right now. Cold blood better than a three or three four four threes. It's just fine enough. I might pick up another one for the last one. I really like cold blood. Mm, and scale nightmare as a potential win condition if I can control the board. I have some removal, it's not a great rogue deck, uh, and it's kind of high value, slow control style, which is a bit curious because many times rogue decks tend to pan out to be 
rather aggressive or tempo control styles. But I should be able to control the board in um, in many instances anyway. Uh, try to play on curve. Get some value out of the cards that I do have. Uh, having scale nightmare as a win condition, or generally controlling the board as win conditions. This is listening as an early win condition as well. Sometimes that will happen. Cold blood as control mechanisms. Yeah. Oh, okay. None can escape my fury. I'll keep the vicious fleshling. Mm. Cold blood is a bit alluring when I do have it, but mm. let's see if I can draw something a little bit more early. I could not. How quick he's on the board. Wow. That's a good follow up to a vicious flash game. Or if he taunts, then I can invent a weapon. Especially if I get a health buff on the vicious fleshling. Wind fury, there we go. Uh, Plus three attack. Justice Let's get rid is of that mine. one. Job's done. Uh, multi shot is really bad here. But I couldn't do anything about it. Torn poisonous wouldn't do anything. Seems like a good curve. I will drop the abomination now. Yeah. 
Greetings, friend. Hail, friend. Uh, where do we go from here? Like crawler, stuff like gastropod. Think. Oh, I actually think that the like a crawler is better here. And if you drop something crazy, then I can just throw up the stuff on the gastropod. Forget to tip your foreign. Okay, I have to just dagger up and manage it like that. Justice is mine. There we go. Turns a little bit slower. You can deal full damage. Or three five with the deadly. Okay. Uh, so this I can do and then drop that one so that that's seven damage. How much is that worth? Hmm. I think that's I a bit. Of, there's a lot of surprise damage. I actually like to keep that because that is like two, four, to six damage. So I think this is better in order to build the board. I cannot do oh yeah, of course I cannot have attack. No. Really, really good here. Perfect counter to that one. I do play into Lightning Storm somewhat, but. He's just rolling those one one children and follow along. Reduced in mana utilization. So next turn here, I actually have lethal, unless he manages to do something with his five mana, and I can remove whatever he drops if he has one big minion. So he needs another answer.
I wonder. Yeah, I wonder too. Why do I take the turn so fast that I miss out on important stuff? Commander that you poison. No taunt, please. Okay, no taunt. That would have been an instant pick. Good. Oh, come on. Getting close, but on, on finishing him off, but put this apple on your head. We're also getting kind of close now. Darn. 
Okay, let's see this one and this one's coming back. I wanna keep Marga Corsair. Just as a three. Trying to play is to dagger rock, get the points and then hidden. Oh, stone hill defender. Get rid of the totem and take a bomb. Hmm, I wonder. Next turn I can either Naga Corsair. To get rid of, for instance, if I have four, I think that's actually better. Or I can fire up in Phoenix if it's four or five. Yes. Justice is mine. I should be able to get rid of this four drop no matter what. If he drops nothing, then Nara Corsair is the better one. Ash to ash. See? I just get to eat that. No oh man, I want to get the most power out on the board, and I have an venom weapon. Which makes the additional mine. attack that I'm wasting now not that important. Anyway, next time I can remove other spot remover. Use my health to remove something. Okay. 
Chase by Phil Smith. What's my alternative? Stonehill Defender, Dagger up. Allows me to clear. Hmm. I wonder. Uh, or a Spiteful Smith. This does not allow me to clear, but how much? Uh, I get more power out of the board. Hmm. Uh, I think there's some value in doing that. I actually had a overload as well, yeah. We need a little bit more heavy cards. Let's avoid the face damage there. Overloaded for two, three. So he only has four mana. Too bad I can't use that extra. Mana for anything. Next turn, five and dagger up, or fire plume, and button. Uh, we'll keep the charge actually, just in case that I need to do something like that. Alternatively, I can of course also dagger up and let him weapon, which gives me an additional charge, and then stubborn gastropod. I think that's actually pretty good. See that this is such a low attack. Move, remove, remove. Very much so, actually. Some stuff here, shouldn't we? To Northrend! Justice is mine! Victory! Do this. What else? I just no, I want to also get rid of that one. So four hidden. I don't have five left. Man, 
Oh, this is a, it's a very good fit. Hmm. But... I'm not ready. <laughs> He's making some desperate moves here as well. Trying to control a little bit. Okay, maybe that's just so I won't clear. Wow, that is it. Some crazy insane burst. I'm in a bad spot, otherwise, uh, we can just drop the Mastodon next turn. And then it's expected he does not have an answer. That's not nice. Alternative would be to do this, and I can clear that one. I think the biggest burst mm. they have is, uh, of course, except for Malakia, which this one would protect against. I need to drop the master die. Plays around the most things. Yeah. Justice is mine. There you go. Set some lethal as well. No trolls. I'm not picky about my two, so I'll keep that one for sure. This is probably a bit safer. Laser up, locked up. Reporting for duty. Well, he can't. I 
I will drop the Silithid Swarm on now. Then dagger up next turn. That leaves the more power and health on the board. I can dagger up now, clear. But then the board is not strong. Drop the Vicious Fletchling. And just say you don't have an answer for this. Then he might. Hmm. I wonder. Just the blessing of might. I think that's an answer for it. Quickly. Hmm. I wonder. This is the better choice, leaves the more power out there. Could it be like this? What's the right move? Justice is mine. Probably need to bump that on him. No matter what. No, this is a very weak turn four. Let the pain speak to me. This goes quite well in hand with him having a weak turn four. So I will drop the stubborn gastropod and this is fetching. Killing spree. Hopefully, either a good assassinate or nesting rock will, will do some work. This only works on the simple minded. Reporting for duty. Oh, that is pretty good. Actually, that gets to work. Okay, let's do this first. Let's see what we have. Wind Fury. You should be able an offer it. Yeah, let's get rid of the targeting. Um, do this. Justice. And just clear the door. He's still behind the door. I guess the assassinate. I think this is. He's in a bad spot now. Let me think. Back to your home. I think I don't have lethal next turn, right? So, three, six, ten, nine, Reporting thirteen. And then a turn 3 play could be dagger, deadly poison, and then turn 4 fire problem. I don't have that many turn 2 or turn 3 plays, so to have one in your opening hand, both 2 and 3 is pretty good. How about the 4? I think that is also good enough to control the board with. Justice is mine. 
and then he might play a... What does he really have us? Well, he can... Um... What can he play? Of a nice nesting rock. Just a clear. More for me to remove. Uh, well, it's not yet torn, but it's not. Required. Okay, what do I do next turn? Then I can burn the circer and then dagger up. Setting up for an venom weapon. Eek. And then maybe whatever I've drawn, hopefully another four. That's still clear. You think getting caught in range to me? Not yet. Worth silencing that one. I think I can push some face damage here. Making 8 7. I think I'll do that. Just this is not too bad. And then this is in preparation for the next turn and a lot of face damage. My pressure is on. I can clear whatever he drops now with my dagger and Nine. next turn. Reporting for duty. Okay. Well, I can device clear and deny him the card draw, which is probably as good as Good enough value, but he's playing around the envenom weapon. So what does he have? Can I push for lethal next turn? Thirteen. Yes, I can. So he needs to have something to clear my board with, or else I can just if he taunts devil swarm, walk just it through it clear the way. I'm saying you need to have an answer right now in the form of removal or taunt. And taunt, I can take care of. And you can't just right off the bed anyway remove my stuff. Okay. Okay, this is something I end up warring use the dagger now. <sighs> the most, ef most efficient use of my mana with this hand is the George Devil Sword. Next turn I can buy the ancient one. And I'll still hold the weapon I have enough health to last. If he drops a big one, and this is not completely a setup for lethal. I need the assassin's blade and something else. <coughs> He's probably choosing a bigger taunt. Let's try and save my weapon here.
Or if I draw assassinate, I could probably bait out whatever he's drawn. Forbidden healing. That scoundrel. Okay, let's see here. Easy. This is playing around. Noble sacrifice. And what's the map? Anyway, go though, okay. The value place. Business. It's not an elemental. Uh, okay, I'll clear that one. Use six health on that. And then I can push face for 17. Uh, Stonehill Defender. And then if I get Tar Creeper, that would be good because then Lethal is set up. Okay. Other than that, I just use this one. Hmm. And the Assassin's Blade. Okay, let's let's get a card first here. Yeah. Okay, what could be the better choice here? I think so. Yeah. Justice is mine. You can't hide from me. You be playing torch. Like a lot of torch. The victory is yours. Okay. Uther! I will fight with honor. None can escape my fury. <coughs> he traded two. Defender, War Coin, a Baron Berserker, mm. yeah, Stonehill seems fine. Pretty good. Sure. Preemptive hit. Justice is mine. Sure. 
I was thinking about just coining the dagger next turn, but this gives me the, gives me the option to use the Stonehill Defender. Fine, I'll start to use it right away and then I can finish off the great flurry if I ever fall behind. There we go. Next turn, I can nest in rock or drop a twisted wall and shadow rage. Yeah. Something about I it. Wonder. Uh, or I can hit in and then break flurry. Not and three and then potentially a six. That's nine plus three. That's twelve. That is simply too low. Oh, I have to do it. Justice is mine. Pretty awkward, but I have to do it. Into his turn six as well. Just a match. Winner of yes. Empires. Target that he could have pulled. Want to concentrate? Oh, okay. I guess that's fine. Hmm. He does not have. Alternatively to the primordial drink, I was just reaching for that over, right, over, right away. Uh, didn't scale. I don't have any direct response to that one, so that would definitely I would lose that 100% of the times. Then that or I have five left, and it would be the aberrant. No, this is better. This is indeed a lot better. Do I clear? 
Yeah, I'll be playing around stuff. Still have enough health that I can use it to control the board. Nine mana next turn. I get dagger, deadly poison, scaled nightmare, spiral out of control. It's a win condition. Out of my jungle. Reporting for duty. Another one. Next turn I'll have 12 plus 3, 15. I uh, got it. Up against, actually, just use his hero power in turn two. Using a, a deadly poison on. What else do I play? A ferryman. Or do I coin the city that swarm? Next turn, I can dagger I and use the swarm actually. Really play with me to use. No, but I have another. I have a venom weapon in there. I have uh, assassin's blade as well. Sit up that swarm and then get some ferryman next turn. Justice is my To answer it because I mean, it's a blessing of King's turn. No, thank you. Uh, I am thinking of Stone and Defender. But it's, 
It's a three, four, three. I guess that's fine. And then I can. Justice is mine. Nesting rock or abomination next turn. Most likely he he will bump into that. If he chooses not to push the wasp in, then abomination is pretty good, I think. This only works on the simple minded. Reporting for duty. Turn. Hmm. I wonder. If that is the case, I would like to clear that one. And then what? Nesting rock, abomination. Stop on gastropod still. We still have really bad against this board. But I guess not if I clear. Scaled Nightmare seems really fine because with a cold blood that can really spiral out of control. It doubles, right? Double this attack. I, yeah. <laughs> I think I have enough tools for it to succeed. Something else could have daggered, shadow rage. What uh, we'll all do next turn is abomination, cold blood, little face. to the defiance cleaner cold blood that's more power out there but then of course you can get to it hmm. I wonder when you have two life left so it's a weapon would be all the bad but when there's only two life left abomination wouldn't be that good either next turn I can protect it with a nesting rock I think that is actually even better. I don't have any turn four stuff. Yeah, that's actually better. 
Just act natural. Pretty close to lethal anyway. Generator bump in. Playing not that much around, we'll be able to bait out in two damage anyway. Easy. Job done. There we go. The next turn is either Sharath or Blood of the Ancient One. And if it does not charge in, I initiate the trade and then let's see. This was actually a better play than the Abomination. Dagger, Venom Weapon, and Abomination. I want to hold off aggression. Oh, do that best. Through that. I really have to conserve my health at this point in time. But I had an earlier read that he probably had. Oh, okay, 10 damage. Wow. Crazy. As soon as this dies, I have two life left. Need healing. You got a pair. Ugh. Reporting for duty. How many minions? All three. None at all. I think this is the most. Think. That is the winning move. And but any charge, any anything. Quickly. He 
he shoots Brent out on the board, and if he does that, then he probably wins. Um, Ow. Face the airs of magic. Ow. Yes, he did the right thing there. Damn it. Oh. I was hoping that he only had a few big minions. Silith is warmer. Throw the other two back. Hmm. Looks like I'm daring on daring on two. Which is fine. <laughs> it's time for a little blood. I'd like to keep the option open for a, an venom weapon next turn, right? <laughs> Money, that's a good trade for him, but he actually skips his turn. Pretty good for me. Not too thrilled about that. Just act the market. There we go. Tiger and Venom weapon. Same trick. Oh, no, I can't. Just make sure to give him a lot of damage. And 
<clears throat> Mistakes were made. They were? This only works on the oh, same man. Well, sick and fido. My minions were a little bit cheaper. I guess I'll need to assassinate and then blow another nesting rock just to stay alive. That won't work either, actually. Uh, and he has lethal through the the little folk. Quickly! I'll need to finish it off myself. Justice is mine. <laughs> See the rewards. Fair amount of gold, one hundred and five. See the pack. Thanks for watching.